juice milk? Yeah, I, yeah, six weeks. You and me both new kids. <laughs> Have you seen those uh, in-season tournament courts, and what are your thoughts on the Rockets? Uh, yeah, we've been looking at it. I think it's exciting. I think it's a good time. Um, you know, we're trying to drive uh, um, excitement for this part of the season, and uh, I'm, I'm looking forward to it. So I think it'll be fun for the fans. It'll be a good experience in high-stakes basketball early on in the season. So it um, should be a lot of fun. Do you think this is an opportunity for this group in particular in season tournament to face a bigger squad and have, as I said, high-level competition for the year? Yeah, I don't, I don't think, I think it'd be more of a catch for an older team. You know, I think all of these games got to matter to us right now. So, uh, but it's, it's something to strive for. It's something to put, you know, on the board and say, you know, we're going out there to achieve. But for us right now, just trying to lock in on every single game and, and play it like, you know, every every night matters. Coach said communication was a huge emphasis in today's practice. How did you try to encourage the young guys with that kind of mission of better communication? Uh, you got to understand what we're doing. I think, you know, it's, easier to talk when you know what you're talking about. So uh, just kind of get more familiar with the, the things that coach wants us to do out there on the floor. Um, we've been doing a lot of switching, a lot of different things on defense. So, it, you know, it's going to require us to get to know each other. And, uh, you know, I know a lot of you guys have been here, but it is still a new group for us. Um, a lot of us being here for the first time. So it's going to take some time to, to get that familiarity. How much technical has there been with you and Alfie? You guys pretty much switch everything except for sometimes when he's involved. Like how much on defense that you guys talk about what you're trying to do? Yeah, every day. It's a it's an everyday thing. Um, but you still have to have the game experience. You still have to be in um, those you know situations, um, different situations that the game that was at you last last game was a perfect example. It's probably the hardest team to guard and switch against. Um, so it was a good test for us. We did some good things, but definitely um, a lot of areas. To when do you go from trying to learn everybody, figure things out, to uh, trying to chase some things around and win some games? Uh, you know, it's a fine line. It's a fine line. You know, there's, um, myself personally, obviously, there's a, a lot of things I have to try to accomplish as, as you know, the, the guard for this team. But um, I think more often than not, just making sure that we're doing the right things every single day, approaching the game the right way, and uh, everything else will take care of itself. But, uh, I'm not, I'm not trying to give any games away, for sure, but uh, definitely, you know, the aggressiveness will come, come in time. What have the conversations been like with the men so far in trying to help him understand when he needs to be aggressive and looking to get his own shot versus trying to get the team involved when he's running the show? I mean, he should be aggressive all the time, honestly. I think that's, you know, in this league, it's hard to be a guard if you're not going to be aggressive. But I think just making sure we get a shot coming up the floor, and that, that comes with, you know, organizing and, and get guys in the right spot and just taking care of the ball. So um, we get to our spots, we run our stuff, and we're organized. We usually get good shots. We get in the paint, and good things happen for us. And, um, you know, he's, he's finding his way there uh, at getting better each game. How valuable is practice for a young team in this game? Um, sounds like a trick question. No, uh, not. <laughs> um, it's very valuable. Oh, just because you don't get a lot of it during the season, just because of how many games you kind of get stacked on top of it. So, I guess, how can you take advantage of this? Um, I think that you got to find the, that carryover. You know, whether it's shoot around, meeting, film, practice. There's, you know, there's times for us to figure things out um, in the film room, carry that over to the court, and then carry that over to the game. And I think learning that process for the young team is like, okay, how fast can you apply what you know, the coaches are presenting to us? And that's kind of the phase that we're in right now. Thank you. Thanks, guys.